Get ready for another apocalyptic game. So we're headed to Day is Gone. It's finally here. So I don't want to look at too much when they first showed this game for E3 uh, during the press conference for uh, Sony's press conference at E3. I don't want to spoil too much and just look at it. But just looking at the gameplay, I was very hyped for this game. And uh, at first, it looked like it could be a, it could have been a multiplayer game just to imagine it. They could have. But me personally, I prefer single player games and just not every single player game that's out there, whatever you play on, whatever platform that you prefer to play on, not every game needs multiplayer to stand out. And Days Gone is just going to be one of those games, I think, for this year's 2019. All of the releases that they got, all the different games that's coming out, good variety. And Days Gone is just going to be one of those single player games that's probably going to be able to It'll probably be a top tier, but um, I don't look at reviews. I don't look at uh, what other it was just the scores of a, a video game to decide whether or not I want to get it or whether a movie to see how it is. If it decide I want to see it, I just want to just go based on what if I like the game, then I'll try to give it a chance. Every game deserves a chance, and um, regardless of what you like to play. But I'm glad that games like this are, is out because it's a single player experience game. We need more single player games out there. And most would probably say single player games are boring. They're not that fun. Most would prefer multiplayer over and over and over. It gets boring. And uh, it's all about the story and just the fun factor of a single player game. And I think this game is just going to be one of them. Just to say it again. But let's show y'all the back. So here it is. This world comes for you. It says, survive a dangerous life on the road as outlaw biker Deccan. St. John, face freakers, that's what they call them, the little zombies, and I guess the different creatures that you run into in this game, face freakers and merciless humans in a world ripped apart by a deadly pandemic, explore a harsh open world, craft weapons and upgrade your bike, and discover a gripping story of personal loss, see, and now that keyword story, I want to see how the story is going to play out. And uh, just as you can see it right here, 46 gigs, that's a that's going to be a pretty long download. Shouldn't take me too long, though. But it's a single player game, one, only one player by Ben Studio. So I'm really interested to see how this is going to go uh, for this. But just like I said, it doesn't need to be multiplayer to stand out or he knows it himself right there. See him? You're looking into the camera. He knows that a single player game still continue to stand out. But I'm just going to be jumping into this uh, early tomorrow because I don't want to just try to I would try to play some tonight, but I don't want to just be up playing this game and then just not have energy to try to play this as hyped as I am. So I just showed you all the the game, the game from the inside. I know it's not a you no know, art book because they don't do those anymore. I wish they did that. Remember back then they used to do that. See, but you get these little inside designs. Here's the game. Here's the game. This day is gone. But see, let me show. Try to zoom in so you can kind of see it. A little bit if it could focus see looks pretty good you see a little background now let me take this out real quick because maybe you'll be, you guys will be able to see some more details see how it's all flashing see sort of kind of you can but but that's pretty cool though let me put this go ahead and put this back i want to knock him down <laughs> but i'm excited for this so that's all y'all can see that's it, no instruction booklet or anything like that that you used to get from the old days from when you get games. But I'm excited to jump in and check this game out for what it is. I want to see how the story is. I've seen a little bit of the gameplay just to try to take a, get a quick glimpse of it. Only watched like two minutes of it just to try because I don't want to just see too much and say, oh, well, I've seen this from the trailer. I've seen this at this point. And not to be just completely a surprise and everything just be so predictable and just familiar from what you see from the gameplay when you go to play it so i don't like doing that for any game that's out there knowing everything that's going to happen and just seeing predicting the lines and stuff oh, i recognize this from the trailer and all that but that's our unboxing for day is gone so i'm really excited to see that not only that it's a playstation exclusive it's something different it's another one of those single player games that that's going to probably stand out for this year i think but i'm going to find out on my own 
and see what it's going to be like when I go to play through it throughout the weekend. I'm not going to rush through the game. I'm not going to be in a hurry to try to beat it before anyone else and say, well, I beat it before you. I know everything about the story before you do and just spoil it for other people that want to probably want to get into the game. It might be interested in the game and, and maybe on the fence of probably getting it and maybe picking and choosing between games like World War Z or what Mortal Kombat 11 or maybe some other games that's coming out. Uh, the next month like rage 2 for example just different variety of games whatever your game your your game taste may be so i was just interested in playing this game i'm excited to jump in ride around on a bike i got my upgrades right here with the pre-order codes you get bike upgrades and the gas tank upgrades i didn't look at all that yet so i'm gonna put those in while the game downloads so i'm so excited to jump in see what day's gone it's gonna be and get chased by zombies and try not to get eaten up <laughs> and be zombie food. But uh, I hope to catch you guys this weekend. And uh, even if you guys want to, if you guys get the game, you guys don't have to watch anything that I do just to avoid spoilers.